The Grants County Department of Parks and Recreation are having a fun improv camp that you can join. We're going to put the information at the bottom of the screen while we play an improv game where we have to guess which job we're interviewing for. Maybe it's a game you'll play there. Thank you for seeing me about this job opportunity. I'm very excited for this interview. <laughs> Let's uh, skip the pleasantries. Um, so uh, what is your current workout routine? Uh, I eat a lot and then I sleep a lot. You consider that working out? If you do it right. How regular are you? Are you able to control your bowel movements? I mean, absolutely not. But when you know you do what you do right, you mm. don't care about whether or not you have bowel movements. Say, like you just want to get the job done. Say you've been progressing. Say you get this job and you've been progressing during the day and you've been going through a like five hour session um, and you really have to use the bathroom, but you've got another two hours left to go. Um, are you able to hold it or are you going to have to like excuse yourself? Oh, buddy, I'm going to grip it and rip it. Oh, okay. Grip it and rip it. Okay. Now, now how are you with, um, sometimes hotter than hot temperatures, especially when it comes to said bowel movements? Like body hot or like temp like outside, like weather hot? Both. I, I like my weather cool because my fat keeps my body hot. I'm going to throw a couple scenarios out there at you. Okay, hit, so you, hit me. So hit you me. don't work out um, except for no. I work out. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but let's just say this this position is open to you. Um, would you be flexible enough to accommodate what your clients are going to need from you? Well, I always like to say I can put my legs behind my head. That's good. That's how flexible I am. Yes. Is it? But in the workplace now, um, any uh, past injuries we need to know about? Uh, hernia. What's your um, uh, stance on uh, uh, daily showers? Oh, unnecessary. So how often do you say you shower? As, you know, whenever the motion takes me. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, what's your stance on spandex? <laughs> Love it. Love it? Love it. Do you wear it all the time? I mean, unless, you know, I'm naked. To get this job, I want you to know I'll do anything it takes. <laughs> if I have to be naked, I'll be naked. Now that was a test question. That was a little creepy. <clears throat> Look, when you do it right, people don't care what you're wearing. That's true. All right. So um, what do you think you're applying for? <laughs> what am I, aerobics instructor? You're close. <laughs> what Yoga. <was> yeah. <laughs> Thanks for coming in. I'm very excited. Um, you're one of our top candidates. Um, just a question to you know make sure we know each other a little bit more. Did you have any pets growing up? I did. What kind of pets do you have? Dogs. Really? Um, so what made you get interested in this field? You know... I love pets, so I, I don't know. I've had a, a big love for pets. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just dogs, though. Mostly dogs. Mostly I mean, dogs. Mostly any, anything will. Yeah. Any, anything any, will any kind of animal. Mm -hmm. Let's say um, you're doing your job. Emergency happens. What's your first step on making sure that the emergency is solved? I think you should notify the police. <laughs> And they'll solve it for you. <laughs> I think I know okay, what this um, is already, but yes, is it Bigfoot something or other? <laughs> <laughs> something to do with Bigfoot? <laughs> nope. All right, All right never mind. Okay. Right, so, okay. Um, here we don't really outside sources like that don't really apply. Uh -huh. Um, they need to be handled in house. Okay. So let's say that. Someone comes to you immediately, and you, you, and you need to get your gear on. Mm -hmm. do, you, how, do you know how fast that you can put on your gear? Do, Pretty quick. Yeah. I mean, it's not that hard. I'd still advise them to call the police instead, but I, I can. Uh, put like my... I said, um, <laughs> <laughs> um, it's not that kind of emergency. Uh huh. Um, nothing's. No laws are being broken at all. I could put my gear on fast. fast. To answer your question. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And um, are you are you and you're certified, right? Yes. Okay, that's good. Um, where did you get your, your certification at? Uh, it's actually FDA approved. Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> um. And I, I admire I, I admire the confidence. But what what do you think FDA stands for? Food detection analyzation. <laughs> um. <laughs> Uh, okay. Um, okay, that's fine. Um, anyway, as, as I was saying, so um, so you jump in, right? Jump in. Um, 
Yes. Mm-hmm. So they're hurt. There's a cut. Mm-hmm. What do you do to make sure that they are safe from the others and the fact that you have to help out? Well, I would ask the others nicely to stop. <laughs> How am I doing so far? <laughs> Not good. <laughs> okay. Um, but I need to make sure that all these animals are safe in your hands and that you know what to do once you're down there. Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's say one animal is picking on another animal. And it ha this happens time to time, but nothing you can't handle. But they just have to be separated. So what's the first thing? You come into work and say, hey, Marshall, um, this animal is picking on this animal. It needs to stop. What's the first thing you do? Well... Cover your ears for a second because uh, it's going to get loud. I would walk over nicely and say, Stop it! Enough! What do you feed our uh, animals here? Berries. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not laughing. Right, what, what job are you applying for? Something like a zookeeper. <laughs> Pretty close. <laughs> Marine biologist. Uh, I thought you were